problem where your radiators seem to be hot at the top, cold in the middle, and hot at the bottom. So you, what's happening is we, you've got trapped air in the middle of the radiators. And what you basically need to do then is to bleed your radiators. By bleeding, what I mean is taking out the air from the valve at the side of your radiator. Normally, every radiator has two sides. The side there where you can take the water out, the dirty water out, and this side with what we call a bleed nipple. Now you can buy these things from most DIY stores. Mine is with this unique contraption. It's nothing more than a, a key that fits into your radiator, the bleed valve. It takes out the dirty water and traps it in there. So you position this at the end of your radiator and you turn it anti-clockwise until you hear a hissing sound. Now that hissing sound means there's water in your radiators. That hissing sound, now that hissing sound means there's a lot of air in your radiators. Can you hear that? Now, followed by water. So you've removed all the trapped air and then you should have a little bit of water coming out of your radiator into your bottle and then you turn it off. And there you have it. Radiator bleeded. No more air trapped inside. So when you put it back on it should be as hot as the other ones.